Hi, I'm Leslie Bensley, Director of the Morris County Tourism Bureau. Morris County is home to four National Historic Landmarks and many cultural and recreational attractions. Learn more at morristourism.org. Morris County, New Jersey's great American getaway. We are here to recognize the accomplishments of a distinguished New Jerseyan, John T. Cunningham. Born in Morristown in 1915 and raised in Mendham, John graduated from Morristown High School in 1932. He attended Drew University, graduating in 1938. After several years as a reporter with the Daily Record, he became a staff writer with the Newark Evening News. Then, quite by chance, one of John's editors at the News asked him to do a series about railroads. Eventually, the articles were published as Railroading in New Jersey, John's first of 52 books. His magazine series covered the 21 counties of New Jersey. John drove every road and went to every town in the state. The articles were published by Rutgers University Press in 1953 as This is New Jersey, from High Point to Cape May, and the book has never gone out of print. An amazing output of books about the Garden State followed over the next six decades. I, I think he's a natural-born storyteller. It comes out in uh, how he speaks and how he writes is not much different than having a conversation with him. He's a very conversational writer. Anyone who writes knows that one book leads to another. And the books pile up in my head and I, I'm well enough to be able to get most of them out. Dr. Clement Price of Rutgers, one of the state's most respected historians, said, John does not write the idiosyncratic narrow story. John writes the grand narrative. John wrote another series for the New York News called Tercentenary Tales, and he traveled the state giving lectures to historical societies. John has long been known as New Jersey's popular historian a title given him by the New Jersey Historical Commission, of which he was one of the founders. John has never rested on his publishing laurels. He's been a man on a mission. There has been little or no interest in, in our history in this town for many years. And I'm talking about centuries. In 2007, John published his 50th book, The Uncertain Revolution, Washington and the Continental Army at Morristown. The book tells the story of the survival of the army at Jockey Hollow. John, who has been involved in over 20 documentary films, many with NJN, had previously won a television Emmy for his documentary, Dreams of Distant Shores. Thanks to Dillard and Adrian Kirby and NJN, The Uncertain Revolution was turned into a 27-minute documentary. The book and movie have gone a long way in raising awareness of Morristown's strategic importance in the war effort. The movie had the honor of being picked up for national distribution to the 354 member stations of PBS. Showing the movie to a national audience will generate interest in Morristown and bring heritage tourists to our area to hear the story of the two winter encampments. One day, one hopes with John that Morristown's story will be told as often as that of the Valley Forge winter, the winter familiar to all American school children. John has dedicated his life to bringing out the color and detail of the tapestry of New Jersey's rich history. He has long promoted a statehood identity that we can be proud of. Tonight, we honor and thank John Cunningham for all that he has done for Morris County and the Garden State. Mr. New Jersey, what is your secret? Get out of bed every morning with a laugh if you can. And eat a good breakfast. And just keep going. <laughs>